In March 2023, the French Military Air Expertise Centre, based in mont de marsan announced that it had just received the first Rafale fighter bomber upgraded to the F4.1 standard, and that the 130 Côte d'Argent Fighter and Experimentation Squadron would promptly put it to the test. The test campaign, conducted notably in electronic warfare and armaments, involved the Directorate General of Armaments, DGA, expertise centres, including DGA flight tests, DGA information mastery, DGA aeronautical techniques and DGA missile tests. After the test, DGA announced that it had qualified this new version of the Rafale. However, it was only adopted by the French Air and Space Force, AAE, in August 2023. The Ministry of the Armed Forces at the time said, Signed document from the Deputy Chief of Plans, Programs of the AAE. Adoption is a regulatory framework allowing the forces to fly a new standard aircraft, previously qualified by the DGA, while some equipment still needs to be tested. This decision provides the opportunity for aircrew to begin training on the new functionalities provided by the new standard, while optimizing resource utilization. More specifically, this decision marked a first step towards the operational service entry of the Rafale F4.1. However, it will still take some time before this becomes effective. On February 23rd, the AAE announced that the Rafale F4.1 had been engaged for the first time in support of operational readiness at Airbase 118 in mont de marsan in southwestern France. It added, For several months now, the forces have used this next-generation Rafale for training missions. It has now achieved full operational capability, enabling it to carry out operational missions, such as air policing. As a reminder, among other features, the Rafale F-4 has increased data exchange capabilities and better protection against cyber threats. It includes the integration of the Scorpion helmet site provided by Thales, improved fire control to fully exploit the potential of the Meteor air-to-air -air missile, which can be managed by another aircraft than the shooter, an enhanced spectra threat detection and avoidance system, and an even more powerful RBE-2 active electronically scanned array radar. However, these new features will be integrated into the Rafale incrementally. General Stefan Mill during a parliamentary hearing said, In terms of quality, the standard deliveries under the 2024-2030 military programming law will be the Rafale F4 broken down into three substandards. Frontier India specifies these substandards are Rafale F4.1, F4.2 and F4.3. General Millet specified that the incremental advances will include the helmet site, an initial connectivity brick, improved survivability, the integration of renovated armaments, and improved availability. Operational service entry will only be declared when all the capacity enhancements and state-of-the-art equipment associated with the standard are fully integrated, explained the AAE. Now, should the Rafale 4 update help France sell more Rafales, or should buyers wait for the Rafale F5? which is more suited to counter fifth-generation fighters, and since F-5 aircraft will be much different than F-4. You can watch Rafale F-5 standard video. Link is provided in the description. Do let us know in the comments. We discuss such interesting subjects every day. Please subscribe to the channel and share and like the videos.